All right. Do you remember who this girl is, though? <gasps> Tanny. Yeah, I think you voiced Tanny. Uh, yeah, you Ken. voiced Tanny, Marshy. <laughs> How do you like the face shifting stuff? Civilians can't try it out yet, but we're working on getting it cleared for the public use. In the next few years, trick phasing will be national sport of all nations. Imagine if, like, we just stepped on this plate and just phase shift, and she's like, Whoa, you got an imprint? What the fuck? Salutations, child, from far away. I can't look at her. Me neither. You did, did you? Oh. Well, I can, and I'm gonna say, Salutations, child, from far away. Your origin eludes me, for never before have I laid eyes on such garments. Pray tell, whence do you hail? Oh no, Bag says stuff. Well, read it so. for us. Um, you should probably level down your language if you want to talk to kids, robot. A fair point, artifact. I ask of you to hold, but for one moment. There, I've changed my settings to high school. I should make more sense to you like this. I'm normally a conversational android, but my creators wanted to test if phase imprinting was possible for robots. Needless to say, it seems to work perfectly fine. Okay, it finished. Uh, and here's, um, Kaylin. Huh? We don't look like other villagers. That's because we're not from here. I'm Kaylin, assistant engineer to Tanny Hawk. Being able to demo, being able to demo phase shifting this deep into the town is Ow. a rare honor. I was thinking of demonstrating this wisp as well. I'm sure the collectors could use them in their training. These things are real buggers to catch. Wait. Uh. I installed a couple of these plates on my roof ages ago. Forward technology fascinates me. The Science Council promised me a personal teleport plate if I let them have this little demonstration. Where to? There's people. She's the woman. Stop jerking my arm, Riku. <laughs> We're here to purchase new weapons, not gawk -like silly gawk at silly performers. But mom, it looks super fun. Please let me look for a little while. Out of the question, your father and I have already decided you're going to become a collector. You'll have no time for distractions like that if you're going to be successful. What a bitch. Bitch. That's this poor little girl. <laughs> Hello, miss. Oh, well, it's well, it says miss for me because it's me. But anyway. <laughs> Look what I got for my birthday. It's super bouncy. I love it. <gasps> no, 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 no! For Why? Why did you chop down my bamboo? I'll never have the ball that's bouncy again. Look what you've done, Marshy. <gasps> look at what you did, Marshy. Oh, look, it's this person. Let's talk to her. It's Mundy. Who was Mundy? You were. Not I was me, Mundy? that's for damn sure. Oh, yeah, you I was Mundy. Mundy. Hello, I'm Mundy, primary artifact caretaker for collectors. I take sentient artifacts out of the inner shrine and take them for walks and such. When they are old enough, they are worn by collectors. Like little bracelet and Pauji. Pauji? I don't know. Two of my favorite artifacts have already been assigned to the amazing Jean Lemire. I wonder if Jean has a headgear yet. I hope I can stay in timing forever. Getting hit doesn't seem like such a great time. Oh, you'll change your mind once you find a wielder that suits you. I don't see that happening in a thousand years. And these are more merchants. That are way too expensive! <laughs> Let me give me a look-see. Why are you guys pushing me? It's just me being a dick. <laughs> Alright, thanks, Rex. Fishes, fishes, come and buy some fishes. My fishes are great for any occasion, birthdays, weddings, and regular days. All right. Come on, let's go up to the shrine. Wait, where? Oh, up, up, up. oh yeah, okay. Sorry, I was seeing if I could buy anything. Halt! Only priests may enter the inner shrine unless they carry a written permission from a high priest. Whack. We left ours at home. Well, then you better go back and get it. Scram! Bitch. Wow. This guy sure woke up on the wrong side. Now we'll go back in time. Um, like, where's a rift? 
here. Let's talk to these dudes. I'm getting really good at this. I bet if any real danger came along, I'd fend it off no problem. You don't look like you're from around here. What do you think of our humble little village? It's pretty neat, eh? His nick his chin is gonna stab someone. <laughs> oh, come on. Neck beard. It's time to go back in time. It's time to go back to I the present. It. Actually, this is the past. This is the present. Fuck! <laughs> uh, hey, we're gonna have to fight a bunch of shit. I have no EP. They all targeted me. No! Please don't. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I was just about to parry your you. <laughs> Good thing you didn't. Why? Because I'm dead. Oh, I would have saved you if it would have done it in time. Please, no. Okay. God damn it. I'm not good. I got trapped in a corner. Ah! Yeah! That's a uh, link. Like when he falls to his death and like scoured the we'll be in this corner. Princess. He's like, yeah. Yeah. Mercy speaks fluent here. <laughs> <laughs> what did I just say, Marshy? Um. Yeah. <laughs> that was in a very different language, but it was translated. <laughs> You know, if I didn't suck. Oh god. I really need to kill this echo. So I can deal with one, I can't deal with two. Yeah. No, there's another one! The other one's almost dead though. There, he's Got gone. It. There's another statue. I can't kill the statue. There we go. Ah, oh, now there's another fucking shadow. Why are they teaming me? Ow. Well, as long as we don't all die, we might be able to win this. But if one of us dies, we're good as fucked. I'll try to take care of the statue, but no promises. Nope, no promises. <laughs> Ow. Fuck you! Why are you walking behind me? Ah. Marshy's dead. All right, we're fucked. Oh my fucking god! Nope. No! What? The range is ridiculous. Your face is ridiculous. No, your face is ridiculous. Don't die! I do almost no damage to these shadows, so... Because my abilities, they can move out of the way or hit me before I can cast them. Just because the way a fucking two-handed works. Marshy, stop! What am I doing? Moving too much! Put up your shield, dude! This is like chasing you. We can't hit it because it's just running all over the place. Marshy's dead. Revive Marshy before, like, we can anymore. I Fuck. can't. This statue is trying to kill me. Yeah, and the shadow's and it on is, me. And it is going to kill me. Fucking... Thornworms are the easiest. Don't bother killing the thornworms. Yeah, they just move. Yeah. Kill, like, the statues and the shit that throws up the bombs. Especially, number one priority, that fucking Echo of Madness. 
I got your see. puffball, your puffball killed the worm. Oh, my puffball is also dead. I'm gonna kill you. Oh my god, these dudes! I can't see. Okay, well, open your eyes and start hitting this madness. Wait, oh, it's a fucking worm. Just walk away from it, like that. It's the I easiest thing. see it. Oh my god, open your eyes. You hit either the shield button or you walk away. Either works. Stop! Stop! <laughs> this fucking piece of shit! He's chasing me! I can't drink a fucking potion! He won't leave me the fuck alone! There we go. Oh, that was a bad idea. I'm one hit from death. I'm one hit from death. That's uh, it. I couldn't bury you in time. But their barrier was up! The barrier's immediately gone with these guys. <laughs> don't die! Just okay. don't! If I'm the last person to die one more time, I'm gonna cry. Oh, I'm sorry that I do the most damage. You're the only- I will respect all everything. And just make you irrelevant, I swear to god. <laughs> I think the most annoying thing about them is when they just walk behind you and they just fly across the field like in a second. No, no, please, please, please. Give me own chance. That's another thing. Why aren't any of these pieces of shit dropping health orbs? Right? Okay, stop double teaming me, please. How about it then? <laughs> it didn't do anything. His barrier. Five more seconds. I'm dead. Ah! Jeez. <laughs> I'm gonna kill uh, you. I need to I'm... level up. Yeah. It's been so long since I've seen my family. <laughs> I wonder how my wife and kids are. Karen, please come back. I hate two-handed so much. It just won't let me turn. <laughs> There's a health orb. Oh, Someone okay. else get it. Yeah, I'm dying. Here we go. Let's kill one of these. Fucking goddamn it! I'm just not even gonna try to use abilities on this guy anymore because it just runs way too fast. We really need to kill this echo of madness. Yep, there's another one. Great. No, 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 no. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. You have blink. I was stuck in a corner where I literally couldn't use blink. No, God. I barrier you and everything. Uh, no! They break barrier with one hit. Yeah, they do. Why, why, why attack anything other than them when they are on the field? Like, if there's one, what, he was you I should doing? just. Go yeah, you were killing everyone else. You killed a thorn worm and then it spawned him. And now you're dealing with two! I also killed two of them! I mean, obviously he didn't do it right, because, like, I'm being murdered right now! And I can't revive anyone with two things on me. Like, if two of us die, it's game over. If one, maybe. Two, no. Yeah. My abilities don't do anything. I can kill anything other than those. That's why whenever they spawn, we need to focus on those. Thornworms are fine. Leave thornworms. Kill the statues and kill the plants. And if a shadow spawns, immediately focus the shadow. There, I killed it. Okay, kill the plant. All right, what's about to spawn? I'm don't kill, don't, 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 stop, Marshy. I'm dead. All right, well, relax. As soon as this targets Marshy, I'll res you. There you go. Or you can move, I mean, that works too. I'm, just, I'm gonna get blown up now. I'm just running. I'm just keeping them off of you. Okay. Okay, well that was a very good trade. Okay, Marshy, just go in this far down corner. Okay. The fuck, Thornworm? <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. Oh, I'm alive. Wait. Uh, we get one up and the other dies. 
Get in the corner, Candy. Oh, he's on you. Yeah. There we go. Thornworm. Nope, then he's back. And I'm blind in the corner. Oh, and fuck. now you're both dead. Fuck! There he is. He's out. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you. Get out of my way! There you go. <laughs> this is pain. No! He got behind me! What the fuck just happened? He knocked you out of it. Yeah, I know, but he just switched aggro so, like, randomly. What the fuck? You caught him, like, when he was mid-fall. <laughs> oh, I have 39 HP. Um, give me a second. <laughs> Jesus, how long does this go on for? Forever. It really does feel like it, huh? Everyone. Oh my god, that's it! Wait, no, that's it! Just kill these! <laughs> oh, oh. Guess was full health that entire battle. Suck it. Can't uh. wait. They've closed it?! Man, you humans sure know how to lock up your artifacts. These three sockets. The keyholes of some kind. We're going to need some more information. Let's get back in time and ask someone. Maybe that priestess friend of ours can be of use for it to change English. Sorry if I went silent because I actually got like legitimately angry. Oh no, I did too. Hello again, how's it going? I'm sorry I couldn't help you before. Fuck you. <laughs> Don't worry about it, choir girl. You can redeem yourself by answering a simple question instead. The large gate leading to the inner shrine. How does it operate? Pardon? I mean, how does it open and close? Oh, it never closes. I mean, a long time ago, they used to close it, but nowadays it's open all the time. Uh, <coughs> well, let's just pretend it was shut. How does it open? <laughs> History isn't my best subject. I'll try to explain. Uh, see those three emblems on the door? Back in the day, the high priest, master, collector, and the mayor... <coughs> The mayor held held one each. Die quieter. I know. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I'm choking. The door could only be opened when all of them were t got together, and almost no one ever went there. However, as the town grew, many priests moved into the shrine, and the security became impractical. They decided to make copies of the key emblems, and it became easier to get in and out. Too easy, even. All of the key copies made the doors door lose its purpose and they decided to place guards instead but for the last hundred hundred years or so the door has been ma remained open all right so to open the door we would need those three emblems theoretically speaking where could we find some of those oh nowadays they're just like membership badges the priests carry the the emblem of faith the collectors carry emblem of val valor and the all the regular sitems have emblems of loyalty. You hear that, kids? Sounds like getting a hold of these badges won't be as hard as I thought. Eh, why would you want the emblems? Uh, souvenirs. What else? Opening the door in some different timeline? That's just silly. <laughs> when you put it like that, I suppose they can't really be abused. I bet anything that, that the high priest won't give you it. Oh my god. I bet anything that the high priest won't give you an emblem, but I'll try to come up with something. For the emblem of valor, you could try talking to the quest master in the collector's HQ. And then the emblems of loyalty are kept in the house the kept in the house of citizens right behind me. <sighs> Excellent. With my charms and silver tongue, we'll get these trinkets in no time. Good luck. If you wonder about anything else, I'll be here. Hey. Eh. You want an emblem of faith? I'm afraid those are only for members of the church. Can't you make an exception for someone who's traveled from so far away? No exceptions. I'm sorry, my child, but my position on this issue is firm. Oh well, let's focus on the other two emblems for now. Ooh. 
puzzle world. Sorry, kid. I know you're eager to spend your allowance, but you'll have to wait until construction is complete. My, uh, totally licensed workers are in a way as we speak. I really do like this area of the game. Uh, you want an emblem of loyalty? I'm sorry, but I can tell you're not citizens just by your clothes. You just want one as a souvenir. What harm could giving us one possibly have? You can pay if you'd like. If you think no harm would be done, you haven't met my dad. Alright, so there's no way of getting ourselves an emblem except from you? Not unless you break into the back room and steal one. That's what we're doing. Breaking into the back room, huh? Now that's something we'd never do, right, kids? Good. Then I don't need to tell you there's an entrance on top of the roof if you can get up somehow. What a dumbass. It's supposed to be locked, but I tend to forget. On purpose. Wow, you really hate your job, don't you? I do. I really do. <laughs> that's too bad. <laughs> Now, let's go see if we can figure out a way to uh, uh, the roof. Yup, kids! Yeah! The baby did the roof. And we still, like, ruin this girl's poor hopes and dreams. That's fine. Let's go to the collector's hook you. Hook you. This is a gore, I think. No, I think it's a dude. It kind of Welcome like to the dude. collector's HQ. Are you here to hand in a request for help or to apply for membership? Yard. I'm sorry you can't go in here. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry you can't go in here. <laughs> I got into so much trouble when I was younger, and as punishment, they always made me paint stuff. Now I'm so good at painting, they make me do it all the time. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh man, I was almost done with that crate. What's wrong with you? Oh, no! Look what you've done. Look what you've done, Marshy. Yeah, come on, Marshy. Welcome to Collectors HQ. Evil if you're person. in need of assistance, assistance and wish to submit a quest, please fill the Q4R form and and turn it in here. I hate the DMV. Fuck you. Hmm. You want an emblem of valor? I'm sorry, but only those qualified to be collectors could obtain one of those. Wow, this guy reminds me of someone. Trust Who me, is it? we're qualified. Maybe uh, Quentin. Yeah, Quentin. Uh, maybe, maybe Quentin. You know the uh, the present headmaster dude. Oh, he old. He very old. Quite confident, are we? Well, I'll tell you what. Well, his name's Quentin, so this is his ancestor. Yeah, it's, it's a different dude, Marshy. It's not the same guy. Oh. <laughs> I didn't read the Mo name. Kinton, Quinton, come on. Most of the town's collectors God, have been so busy defending against the giant thornworms that. Giant thornworms? Never mind those. Kids shouldn't get involved with boss monsters. Anyway, as I was saying, us grown ups are so busy handling the giant monsters that we have no time for quests anymore. If you could pass the trial of quests, I'll make you an honor. I'll make you honorary collectors and give you one of our emblems. Quests? <laughs> we were basically born for this challenge. That's the attitude. Here, take these two requests we received last week. One's from Sizu, our revered combat tutor. The other is from Bran D, our not quite as revered dam operator. Please speak to them for more details about the requests. All right, kids. Let's show this old timer how professionals do quests. Let go. Ah, so you'll hear about my request to collectors, hmm? I'm glad they sent it outsider, honestly. It's a rather embarrassing request. See, it's about mana. When Tessin and Jamla were young, she always helped me out when I needed her. Over the years, she become, she's become very important to me, and I would like to, you know. Hey. Screw her. I want to fuck her! <laughs> I want to ask her on a date, but I don't know how to do it. All we ever talked about was the children, see? I don't want to embarrass myself, so my request is for you to find out what she likes. I need to know what flowers to give her, what we should eat, and what she likes to do. If you could find these things out for me, I'd be eternally grateful. Oh, 
old man trying to get some puss. Get some yeah, some coochie. Ew. You want to know my favorite food, flower, and hobby? Yes. Let me guess. Old Sizu put you up to this, didn't he? No. A man of his status being so awkward, I find it oddly adorable. Oh. <laughs> Still, a lady can't give up her secrets just like that. You'll have to do me a small favor in return. This is food, flowers, and hobbies. The bridge to my home has been collapsed. If you could find some way for me to for me to get back, I'll tell you my favorite food. Hear that, kids? Let's see if we can get the old bird back to her nest. Gotta go check out the 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 monkeys. Monkeys. Me, ego, ego, help, Master God, poke monkey. Please don't call me Master Igor. You will get the wrong impression. Sorry, Master. Just call me Doctor. Doctor help sick. Master poke monkey. Master not doctor. <sighs> Hello there. I'm Doctor Papa God. Welcome to our humble research facility. Hmm. Have we met before? You look pretty familiar. <laughs> I get that all the time. You've probably just run into one of my many twin sons. For some reason, every single one of them decided to join the village watch instead of becoming scientists. Anyway, we recently acquired a couple of interesting primate specimens from overseas. <laughs> it will be a joy to study them. If they escape, they might ruin the entire ecosystem, so we must be sure to keep them here. Please keep your hands to yourself and don't touch that lever over there. I'm touch it. I'm touch it. Gallon down? No! What have you done? Quick, Igor, cut them! Why did you do this? Why? Oh dear. I hope I can still get research grants after this. I did it. Look what you've done. You're a terrible person, Marshy. God, Marshy. <laughs> the he actual He tried to enjoy his research. 